Hi guys, Terry here. Hey, it is such a load off to have our windows project just about done. Uh, they've got to come back and do the staining, but um, the windows have gone in. The wall is, uh, <laughs> you know, in good shape again, and we're so happy. So I've kind of straightened up the room and I have put together my craft room. So let me give you a tour. If you were uh, watching my channel recently, you saw my declutter series. Um, I did that because I had to pull everything out of my craft room, and I'm so glad that I did it. Um, it was an opportunity for me to go through each of these drawers, um, de-stash stuff that I wasn't using. Um, I attended a garage sale where a lot of us were selling all of our unused items and stuff to be uh, used by someone else. Um, so the garage sale went great, and uh, I'm so happy to just have my room put back together again. So um, we live in uh, Westerville, Ohio, and these homes are um, cabin style. And uh, when I saw it four years ago, I just fell in love with it. So um, I really love how my room has evolved, and um, I've got an area for each activity that I like to do. I like to make cards and scrapbook and also quilt. Uh, one of the new things that I've done differently in this room is I have my um, the DVD, uh, DVD stands, these two shelves. Um, I had my husband stack them here against the wall and he's got them anchored and I love it. I've got my Stampin' Up! stamps there. I even have a shelf here for my um, punches. Those were in a drawer. And uh, love that I can just reach for those and see what I have. That's the trick, right? Remembering what you have <laughs> so that you use it. So I love my wall of color there. And then in these Alex drawers, I have my... Um, glues and trimmers and um, you know items that I need I've got my card making stuff here including my misty and my inks um, so everything's close at hand so that I can I can make stuff right here and of course I've got wonderful track lighting so that I've got um, a well lit space so love that um, I decided to set my computer up here in front of the window um, it's not blocking it too, too much. I've got really large windows there, and I look out over the trees. And my paper and stamps are over here, too. Uh, that pretty much stayed the same. Um, I've got three of the uh, Razcog carts. Love those. And then over here is where I can film and use my Cricut and Brother Scan and Cut and my dye machine. And then these Alex drawers, these are the ones that are on casters. So um, they store just under the table there. I can pull those out. And then I've got my cutting mat and my ironing mats. I can sit on top of those. And those give me a lot more work surface. So I love that for when I'm quilting. Um, I still got projects over here, a stack of things to do. Um, if you saw my post on my website um, our little grand baby arrived a couple weeks ago that's kind of why i've been missing in action and uh, i've got a quilt here to make for him and uh, embroider his name on the uh, minky side of that quilt so i've got that project waiting in the wings here and then i've got my sewing stand so i've got my bernina and the embroidery part of that I've got my English paper piecing project here. Um, I have another sewing machine. I pull this one out. This one just does straight stitches. Um, I like it because it's very fast. Um, so I've just got it stored on the floor there. And then I've got my um, tote for when I go to crops. And I can, that's the uh, Brother Scan and Cut tote. So I like that there. And then I've got some other projects here. This is kind of the project pile corner. <laughs> But yeah, I love it. The room has really come together. Waiting for the ladders to be gone. That should happen this weekend. But uh, 
it feels good to do the clean out and also to have the room uh, back in working order. So, and I've got the stuff at my hands that I that I use. So, it was good to get rid of paper, um, just get rid of projects that I bought that I'm not going to make, and uh, and have a space that really is ready to use when I come in here. So. I hope you guys have a area in your home that you can work on your crafts. And uh, thank you so much for watching. I will see you soon. Bye, guys.